So good. good morning, everybody. Welcome to the Jerome Brown Community Center. My name is Jonathan Anderson. I'm the Tourism Marketing Specialist for Florida's Adventure Coast Visitors Bureau. I want to thank each and every one of you for coming out today for the exciting unveiling of Astoria. We are fortunate enough today to have the artist, Deb Newman, here with us, um, as well as Mayor Blake Bell from the City of Brooksville and David Howard from Parks and Recs with, also with the City of Brooksville, as well as our sponsor, Sonny Vergara of the statue. And it's in honor of Vicki Smith, uh, who is his sister. Vicki was a wiki-wachi mermaid from 1957 to 1961. She's been featured in many books, magazines, and most recently was recognized as a Florida icon by Florida Trend Magazine. Our artist, Deb Newman, painted this mermaid called Astoria. Astoria's story is keeper of all life in the brackish intercoastal waters and beyond. Her mission is to eliminate the invasive hydrilla plant that destroys the habitats of the otters, turtles, fish, and birds. Deb is a self-taught artist from Columbus, Ohio, who relocated to the Tampa Bay area in 2013 with her husband and two Bijons. She enjoys painting outdoors, creating animal portraits, and portraitures in a variety of mediums. I uh, want to thank you, John, and your team for all the work you put into all of the mermaids around the county, uh, but particularly, obviously, the the ones that we have in Brooksville. We're so proud of the mermaids that we have in Brooksville, especially this one, which is gonna be a highlight of our um, new uh, Kiwanis and City of Brooksville splash pad, uh, which is only going to build on um, the tourism that we have that comes into the county and the city. So we're really looking forward to unveiling this mermaid. So excited to have it as uh, part of it. Uh, appreciate the sponsor uh, for sponsoring this mermaid. We'll always be thankful and grateful for that. And uh, this will, for generations, kids will look at this mermaid as they play in the splash pad and, and look at it with the light. Um, and we're thankful for the artists as well. So thank you. I just want to say thank you. Um, thank you to um, Deb. Thank you to everyone who took part in this. Um, I also want to say thank you to Natalie. Um, you've done a great job by being able to identify certain programs as well to help highlight our community. Um, we just became a trail town, so um, once the splash pad gets um, put up and once this um, is in its final resting place, um, I can imagine that there will be a lot of people on the trail who will come specifically just to see some of the um, mermaids that are scattered throughout the city. So. <laughs> It's, it's an honor to be featured here at the Jerome Brown Center uh, with my mermaid, Asturia. I'm very proud of the opportunity that I had to participate in this project. And I hope that the children will enjoy seeing the mermaid and uh, for, for years to come. Well, you know, Vicki is, is older than me. I still call her my, my little sister. She calls me her big brother, even though she's three years older than I am, but anyway. Uh, she's had a wonderful and interesting life, but I'm so proud of her because of all the people that uh, she knows and loves her and her family loves her and, uh, and she's just as much uh, a, uh, an icon to us as she is to the rest of the world, I think.